pretty well known that the new Nintendo Switch OLED has a bigger, more vibrant screen, it has a better kickstand, double the internal storage, and a redesigned dock with an Ethernet port. But there are some hidden features of the new Switch that no one really talks about. The most important hidden feature is improved battery life. Now a lot of big media outlets had assumed that the battery life is the same probably because the battery itself is exactly the same 4310 milliamp hours however that OLED screen is more energy efficient. Here's how the battery life of the new OLED compares to the older models when playing Zelda Breath of the Wild. The new screen does even better with games that are darker. So on Metroid Dread, that battery life advantage is even better than Zelda Breath of the Wild. Another thing interesting about the OLED switch is that the brightness settings make very little difference to the battery life. This means you're free to play games at maxed out brightness without worrying about the battery life. The Switch OLED has a slightly better wireless connection. Nintendo repositioned that Wi-Fi chip which means you do get better range and a better connection. Now testing out the download speed on Pokemon Unite, the initial game does download about 10 seconds faster on the OLED Switch. And then when you're actually updating the game which does show the speed right here that's actually a few seconds faster on the new switch as well. I mean, it's just a couple of seconds, but still an improvement. In case you're wondering, the new wired connection is a lot faster than both. It took less than half of the time to download Pokemon Unite using a wired connection. I also noted the range is a little bit better. This test right here shows two bars on the Switch OLED and one bar on the standard Switch. Both units are the same distance away from my Wi-Fi spot. The built-in speakers are also better on the updated hardware. This means you will benefit from that if you play multiplayer games on tabletop mode. Here's a sound test. We'll first play the standard Switch followed by the OLED Switch. So yeah, those two clips kind of settle it. The sound coming out of the OLED switch is richer and sounds a bit better. This next feature here is thanks to a subscriber for pointing it out. We all know about that improved stand. It's designed for tabletop mode in the horizontal position. But since the stand is so large and stable, you can set the tablet vertically. There's not a whole lot of games that use this feature, but there are some like Downwell, Ikaragu, and Punch-Out Arcade. They actually sell accessories for the original Switch that let you set it vertically, but with the new OLED, it's just a hidden feature. The new redesigned dock, it's sleeker with a built-in LAN port, but it does have some secrets beyond that. First, there's the added cooling vents on the new dock. It should keep your console cool while you're gaming. This dock has been opened up by some, and what that revealed is some new video output hardware. This hardware is capable of upscaling to 4K. The HDMI out is now a 2.0, which means it can provide a 4K signal. Of course, of course, a Switch OLED console is not capable of gaming at 4K at this point, but with this new dock, maybe it's Nintendo getting ready for a possible Switch Pro that uses this updated dock for 4K, but only time will tell. So there you have it, if Nintendo's commercials weren't enough to convince your mom and dad or girlfriend or wife to let you get the new Switch OLED, maybe these new hidden features are.